we will be using cram.com as one way to make online flashcards. Once you are at cram.com, come over and click on sign up so you can create your account. It will take you to this screen. You will choose a username, and here I will just use one demo. You have to choose a password, and I'm going to type in fourth grade. And here you will use your ePals email account. And then click sign up. After you have created your account, it will take you to this screen. You're going to click on Create New Set. Then you will type in your title. So maybe put two times table. Subject is math. I would like you to make these private so that you can only view your own. And in description, you will say practice times two tables. Then you're going to scroll down and start making your cards. So here I'm going to start with the times two. So two times two equals. I want this a little bit bigger, so I'm going to highlight it. Then I'm going to come to this button right here, and I'm going to go to large. And I'm going to have to do that on every card. Then I'm going to go to the back, which is going to be my answer. And 2 times 2 is 4. So I'm going to do that. Once again, I'm going to highlight it. Come down here. Click large. Now I have my first flashcard made. I'm going to go to the next one and say 2 times 3 equals... Once again, I like it bigger, so I'm going to highlight it. Now that it's highlighted, I'm going to click this button here, tell it to go large. I'm going to come to the answer side. I'm going to type in the answer, so 2 times 3 is 6. Highlight it and make it large. And then I'm going to keep doing this until I get through all of my two times tables. Once I'm done, I'm just going to scroll down and make sure I didn't miss any. So I have 2 times 2, 2 times 3, 2 times 4, 2 times 5, 2 times 6, 2 times 7, 2 times 8, 2 times 9, 2 times 10. So now I have all of my cards made for my 2 times table. So I'm going to scroll on down to the bottom, down here. And I'm actually going to add to folders. And I'm going to give it a title. I'm going to hit create new folder and put multiplication flashcards. Okay. And update folders. Then I'm going to hit create set. Once my flashcards are made, it will pop up this screen. And here you can see you can practice flashcards. You can go to Memorize. And it will talk you how to do that. You can click on Test, which will test your skills. Or you can go to Games as ways to practice. The cool thing is about this, guys, is you can access this from our tablets, from your tablet at home, or anything like that, there's a free app that goes along with this. Once you have completed your two times tables, you move on to your three, and you'll keep going until you get through all of your ten times tables. Hope this helps you. Good luck, and we'll see you later.